Hey guys, Paul here. I'm going to continue with this how to make a profitable website series of videos. And but we're going to go to social media now and do uh, using Hootsuite to monitor your brand, to uh, find more people to engage with um, and schedule maybe tweets and, and really for monitoring purposes, I think. So go to Hootsuite.com. And then it's there's a free plan. I think for for three um, for three accounts. Let's sign up. Uh, professional. Get started now with a free plan, right? So I'm going to use uh, my name. <laughs> Uh, business email I'll use walkbeer at paulnicholson.com password uh, da, 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 da. create my account so that's all you got to do I'm going to prove it's free to use as well um, verify your account emails just come through so I'm obviously going to have to click on here So this is work. So it's going to be blank. Uh, oh, sweet login. Why is it asking me to verify? I've already done it. Paste your confirmation code. Maybe I didn't do it. So confirmation. And now I'm in, right? So I'm going to connect. Um, uh, what's this? What would you like to do? Publish content, monitor your networks. I'm not worried about that a minute. I'm not worried about this. So uh, you click up here and add a social network. So I'm going to connect my Twitter. Uncheck these unless you want to follow Hootsuite. Uh, log in. And that is Twitter connected. I'm going to. Do three, so Facebook, I don't know if that's the right password or not, and I'm just going to do a world of craft beer, one like, so you can see it's all brand new, and I'm going to do Instagram, and uh, again it's uh, what beer, ah. oh, what is my password for that, be right, oh it is. Authenticize, authorize, authorize, and that is um, set up. I'm not going to go through this. This is how to do it on your phone. To do Instagram on your phone, you've got to set up notifications and stuff. I'll do that later. So now I've got three networks connected, so I can I can post a tweet message across all three. Obviously not Instagram because uh, it'd have to be a picture, but I can post to Facebook and Twitter from there if I wanted to but what I'm really using it for is the streams so uh, set up engage with your audience monitor mentions replies expand your audience listen to conversations so we're gonna do one that is engaging first brands mentions eh, let's do this add to dashboard so that's gonna set up a Twitter um, feed so this is messages in the inbox new followers my tweets um, you could probably put retweets brand mentions obviously no mentions yet it's also a brand new thing so that's Twitter Facebook you can do as well but what I'm interested in is I'm going to add another one here um, I'm just call it search right so in this, I'm going to search for hashtag craft beer. And that will give me everybody who's, who's tweeting about craft beer. So I'm going to save that stream. Save as a stream. Come on.
Engage and uh, browse all streams. I don't know. Craft beer. Now it's there. I don't know where. This seems to have changed last few times I've done it. So add stream. That's done. Right. So what else? So I might do uh, hashtag real ale. Anybody put in real ale? And I'm add that stream. Oh, now it's doing it. I'll delete this stream because it's the same as the one next to it. So now I, you can see that I can see people that are uh, using hashtag craft beer. I can are excited to be asking partnership with now to have to host a beer night, and so I can I can retweet that straight away. I can click on here nine mile legacy a small brewery and follow them so i can find people that i want to follow and this one here is friendly small town da, 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 and i can follow that person as well so i can monitor whatever your brand is you can monitor it in twitter if you're so i could add a stream here that is um uh walk beer i'm sure exactly so i can monitor anybody who's hashtagged or mentioned walk beer walk world of craft beer right so i can add that as a as a stream as well did it three times didn't i so that's why i keep showing up so that's a really easy way to monitor your brand to find out things you're interested in to look at things you know just like them just like everything beer related happy hour on a monday calls for blt is a house of happy hour craft beer bacon you know you can retweet anything you can like it you can go down and as you see people like i say you can click on the name not entirely sure and click follow or unfollow right so that's easy to do on twitter so it's one of the only real social networks you can also do instagram searches right which is makes this will make your feeds fun because you can um you can search instagram for a hashtag so again if we do craft beer an ad stream it's going to pick out proper beer pictures which is going to give anything you share a better look so woohoo crabby this place is nice freddy not fingered line blah 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 right and again you can click on them and follow in instagram because it's a beery person and you can and i'm not quite sure the morality of this yet you can click reshare and send that picture to Twitter, but obviously, you can't, you have to filter it down, right? So this place is awesome at Krabby Clark, and you can send it to your Instagram as well, with your Instagram and your phone set up. So you can just straight reshare it. So if I can send that to my Twitter, and then go back to here, my tweets is going to probably show up in this box here if it wasn't um, so low as hell and you could send it to your Facebook but um, so you can see it's retweeted it's tagged in Dewey I'm gonna follow him just so he don't get mad at me Krabby Clark so from Instagram you can share to Twitter by just searching for just searching for pictures, right? So again you can just reshare. Oh yeah, Bunk IPA. You can share it to Facebook and Twitter, Instagram if you were set up, and send, right? So again, I don't know the full morality of just straight sharing somebody at least you're giving them the the photo credit um but i'm not sure i'm not 
I haven't got my head around that yet, but you can do it. You can see you can do it. So, um, really easy to do. You can see Hootsuite's free to use to do that. So you can add another stream. You can search something else. Um, again, I don't know. Uh, real Ale, did we say? Real Ale. Add a stream. You can tell people to put, you know, hashtag what beer. Um, uh, reconnect. I don't know why it's disconnected. All right, so I have to verify my account with Instagram. Though obviously, I've only just set it up, so I'm not going to do it now. I'll have to go through and and set up my Instagram properly for for what beer. Um, so I think you're getting me drift with with how you can monitor your own brand. You can monitor your tweets. Um, you can monitor Twitter easily. You can add a Facebook stream. Uh, I can do Facebook page, timeline. So you're going to see that picture went out. Um, I don't think it's usually as slow as this. I think it's my computer. And in particular, it's my Chrome uh, on my computer that uh, lately is doing something really funky. So I think if I went to uh, Hootsuite on here. Let's have a look. So yeah, sorry, it's a bit flaky. It's um, it's not usually. I didn't expect it to be like this. So what my? Let's see. See if it's better on Firefox, or if it is just a. It's telling the AC. So you can see on Firefox it loads quicker. There's something wrong with my Chrome. I need to get to the bottom of it so the new tab was Facebook posts they're the Facebook posts um, I don't think you can search Facebook activity pages yeah Facebook yourself you can't you can't yet search Facebook for posts like this that you can like and comment in because you can obviously comment on on your Facebook post but what it'd be great to do would be to get a load of pages that you liked and then comment on their posts as your Facebook page and then that would really spread the word of your Facebook page. So, just a quick intro to um, Hootsuite and, you know, I think you can get the drift that you can search relevant hashtags to your niche and then really start, you know, the AL team follow Right, you can really find people that you want, you want to hook up with in your niche, in your area. Kent Beer Reviews, I think I'm already following him. Yeah, already following, right? So, a little bit sketchy that. Um, I hope it makes sense. Any questions, just send me a, send me a message or write a comment on this video, and I'll do you a quick video on whatever you need to know, um, Hootsuite related. But it's a really cool. You can see it was free to use. And, you know, you can go up and post direct messages to Facebook and Twitter, um, as you'd expect. And there's all sorts of other stuff you can do. But that was just a quite, that was just a beginner setup of how I'm going to use it to try and build those social media engagements. I'm going to go off and talk to other people on their, in their social media. Uh, I'm going to write on, on Instagram comments and I'm going to comment and reply in Twitter and Facebook as well. So, oh yeah, have a good day. See you again soon. Keep following the How to Make a Profitable blog playlist. I'll be adding videos every day, so we can you'll be able to see the um, the world of craftbeer.com website grow uh, day by day.